Welcome back, folks, uh, to another episode of uh, Days Gone. We are on the other side of the map. We are not in Lost Lake. We are. We were actually in a conversation with Addy, so uh, we will just continue. It literally just started, and I managed to put pause just as soon as it started, so we do not miss it out. We actually contact Addy to, uh, I think, find out or check up on Boozer's conditions after we uh, pretty much chopped off his arm, folks. We amputated his arm as he was getting infected, and you know what happens next. So uh, to actually save his life, what needed to be done had to be done. And it was done. So that's pretty much a long story short, folks. Another Sarah mission has popped up. We are on the other side of the map at a old uh, Marauder camp or ambush camp, whatever you want to call it, to actually access not really a Sarah memory or flashback. It's literally just pretty much just to talk with her gravestone, folks, and uh, to, you know, check up on her as uh, Deacon would do. And it's part of the I Remember storyline. It has to be done. Even if you want, I think you don't have to do it. I don't think you have to do it to progress, but I think it, these extra little things need to be included within these episodes to make them, one, more realistic, two, more immersive, and three, I think it's just good to know every little detail of the story just like as i would do in any other game and as you've previously seen in my other episodes folks so folks don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the family follow me on social media keep smashing that thumbs up because i really appreciate it and we're just going to get straight back into this story as i am pretty freaking excited all right let's go to the map uh as we know we are the bear creek yeah this is the bear creek is literally the first one i did and the this is the one i missed out uh, it's the it's the same usual one every time I see it. I just I, I want to cry because it's the one it's the one I love and the one I missed out for you folks where you can infiltrate through this uh, top side here and you got the hung up freakers waiting for you. All right, let's go, folks. He's full of crap. This is Sarah's moral stone, the I remember storyline indeed. And after that, folks, we'll do a side mission if we have any. I don't think we have any, but we another amazing thing that has popped up is another uh another two nero checkpoints so this is a checkpoint oh god is this the sawmill old sawmill near a checkpoint that does look like the e3 gameplay trailer that's gonna have a horde folks so we'll have to take care of the old sawmill horde plus near a checkpoint i think we're gonna have to do that together even if we want to clear out the uh it's on a mission track down a nero field research team you mean track down this Nero research center pretty much. Anyway, folks, we're going to have to do this at some point. So there's no better way and there's no better time doing this together. Uh, we're obviously going to find a horde here. So we'll do the horde. We'll do the Nero checkpoint and we'll uh, head for the I Remember storyline. We'll just uh, keep it going. This episode will be the I Remember storyline. Even though we do have a bounty hunter mission for Ricky Patel, we will do this because we have not done a side mission together for Ricky Patel. And I have missed out this historical marker. How did I miss out a, collect a collectible when I was there for a thousand times? Anyway, but it doesn't matter. We'll do that together as well. This is not a research site. Well, it's not a Nero research checkpoint, but it's a site. So it only contains the Nero injector, but most likely another horde because these are pretty much ways that Ben Studios have hidden hordes. They'll come out of nowhere and they will kill you. It's what has happened to me in many episodes as you've previously seen folks and also just free roaming it just wants to kill me anyway oh we got another research uh site or checkpoint this is another research site i'll have to do these on by myself folks i'll do these two by myself because they're easy to do and it's good for the um stamina and health hand focus or you know for the in-game statistics i don't think any of them or any others have popped up so so far so good deacon st john the lost lake infirmary come back Deke. Hey, it's Booze. Hey. Uh, feeling a little out of it, you know. You okay? What's going on? Booze. Damn, it's good hey. to hear him. Uh, nothing. Folks, we're not hey, going to uh, make it. Got tired of listening to the radio free Oregon. Can only take so much of his truth or bullshit, you know? Deke, uh, Ad Addy told me how I'd be dead if it weren't for you. Getting the anti whatever the fuck's. So. Boozer, I, uh... It must have been fun. Uh, holding me down while she fucking whacked away at me. <laughs> Remember how, uh... How Jack carved up that turkey last time we was all together? <laughs> it kept slipping all over the goddamn table. Yeah, Booze, man. I remember. I still feel it, you know. Knife. Worse than the Rippers. If, if you hadn't been there to... Hold me down. I don't know what would have happened to you. I don't know. Well, it's done, Boozer. It's done. It's over. Ah. Uh, Deke. Uh, 
Sorry, I'm feeling, feeling a little woozy. Yeah. Uh, hey, Addie's gonna kill me if she finds out you're out of bed fucking around. Yeah, I've, I hear a bunk uh, calling my name. Hey, it's Lost the famous uh, Boozer line. Yeah, listen, Boozer. Boo Oh yeah, folks. I've I've also forgot last le well the last episode we've also unlocked the Superior Club, and I did say I was gonna search the town after we were finished, and I did search it, and I found a pipe. Now the pipe is used to uh, craft the Superior Club, which isn't so much better than the Spike Club. It's actually got less damage, but because I like I said I want to keep it fresh within the episodes, I decided to craft this, and we get to use it together, folks. But it's not. Really my style apart from not being my style. It's just not really. I'm not digging it folks I don't think it's gonna be so much powerful. It's like I've got the hard hitter perk and the uh, Typical melee perks that you need to uh, you know just to help you out and you know the advanced skills But yeah, if I hadn't had those this would be a useless melee weapon, but you know, it, it looks good at least it looks good I'm quickly searching this folks is what I need uh, fuel we're not going to have enough fuel to uh, go to the to the location. If we don't find a fuel can in here, we're screwed. Now, for some reason, no fuel can. Come on. This is the location where I got caught by the freakers, folks. This is where the... Yeah, it's in here somewhere. But I don't need to go here now. I don't believe... Boozer put out his amazing, uh, his amazing catchphrase. Absolutely amazing. He put out his catchphrase. I hear a bunk calling my name. <laughs> love to hear it. You love to hear it. Now, I've, I haven't just noticed this, but that body that's hung up on the street lamp there, it just, it freaks me out every single time. As well as these freaking noises in the background. I can't find a fuel camp. This is not good. We'll have to uh, just keep going until the bike stops and we'll, let, we'll have to uh, see if any symbols pop up on the map, folks, because we are very screwed. I don't want to stay 30 minutes just searching for a fuel can. Surely they'd pop up. Come on. Oh, damn it, it's wolves. Really? Wolves? Oh, I can't even kill it because I don't have... Good night. I still haven't turned in all my bounties and all the meat we collected last uh, episode and all the bounties I've had throughout the hordes I've killed. I must have like 500 God knows bounties. I'll have to see, but I have so much stuff to turn in. It's unreal, folks. It is truly unbelievable. All right, let's go. I am literally going on zero fuel right now, you know? Yeah, my bike is literally rolling. I'm going to have to walk it. Great, no fuel. Now what? Can we roll it? Can it go down? I don't believe we're still actually going. Great. Can we walk the bike at least? Is it actually walking the bike? I'm just going to leave it here. I'd rather go by foot, folks. I'd rather go on foot. 500 meters? I can sprint that come back with a fuel can. I might as well. Really? Does the game actually leave you by yourself like this? I would have expected a fuel can to pop out. Like, to pop out. Oh, there's a wolf. Okay, I'll just get it. That's disappointing, though. I need a fuel can. Can't leave my bike there for a whole night. Come on, game. Oh, folks, there's definitely a fuel can at that nearer checkpoint of uh, where we cleared out the zombies, or should I say freakers, for Sarah. So we'll have to literally run back with a fuel can in our hands. And hopefully not run into a moving herd. Because there's definitely moving herds around. So, yep. Gonna have to blame it. Or, you know, put our faith into luck. Take a leap. This is definitely a horde location. Holy smokes. I don't remember a horde being here, though. Or should I say, well... Can definitely hear something. I swear we've killed this horde, though. 
Yeah, this is... No, 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 no. We have not killed this sword. This is that um, horde we were talking about. The one we've been trying to do for ages, even in the episodes. The cave one. If I'm not mistaken, this is it. And I can hear noises which are not... I'm not digging this, folks. I can actually hear him now. Oh, God. Yup. We found one. Are we even ready for this? I think we are. Folks, it looks like we're doing a horde. Right, then. Let's go for the attractor. And pipe bomb. Come out. Come on. Folks, so if you're ready for this, because I'm not. All right, let's get some distance. Here we go. Let's keep this going. Ouch. Is there any left? Ouch again. Leave me alone. Is there even any more? Is that it? Really? That's disappointing. Bear Creek Hot Springs Horde has been completed. That was a small one, but I'll take it. That was easy. I've just wasted my supplies for nothing, but I'll take it. Hot Springs. Not that I needed the Hot Springs Trust, but I'll take it. Hordes are mostly deadly. Thank you. Got you. Thank you. Well, let's take the... Uh, Bounties, not that we need them because we have enough. We didn't even have to use our LMG, so I'm happy. It's fine. It did look like we had a horde in front of us because that was definitely one. That's one scary sound effect and soundtrack, i got to say. I'm not going to lie. That's freaky shit, folks. Holy smokes. Anyway, i got to say the, uh, the location that we were just before here gave it all off. Simply because you could see that's where they uh, kind of feed off. Mm, I don't like this. Let's get this. Uh, nope. There we go. That's better. Yeah, there's nothing in there. When you see these kind of bloody locations with kind of like nest buildups and uh, residues and all sorts of kind of stuff, it means there's a horde nearby or you're actually at the location of the horde. So I knew it instantly. It wasn't a big one, but you know. It's good that we removed it off the map, folks. It makes things uh, a lot easier. Okay, then. Let's get a uh, bandage. Easy stuff. We wasted two pipe bombs and a tractor. And a tractor, two pipe bombs, and... Holy smokes, this was so... This was incredibly near, I've got to say. This horde is literally on the other side of... Uh... Is this a case? Indeed. Let's search it. May have something good. Ammo. Always need that. Definitely can. Five side, uh, five side arm, ammo, and sort rifle. I'll take it. Yeah, folks, this was, uh, I've just realized how near and how close this was to the Sarah, Sarah checkpoint. <laughs> folks, I am going to do this real quick. I'm going to quickly take this to my bike and drive up here. It is pointless doing, like, free, uh, free journeys. I'd rather do this. It just makes sense. We're not that far anyway. We've managed to run all the way up here anyway. So, uh, I've just... That literally baffled me. It was so near. It was so close to the Sarah checkpoint. Or did that near a checkpoint where Sarah's Memorial Stone is. Like, that that horde could have, could have attacked us any day of the week. Anything. Any time that we, we would have been close to it. We go to, the, we go to Sarah's Memorial Stone quite frequently. And, look. They feed off from this location. So, that means they travel... Oh, great. Where's the bear? I hate bears in this game. Where is he at? I heard him. Oh, he's right in front of us. Holy smokes. He's going for the deer, though. He's going for the deer. I need to get to my bike, bear. Just get out of the way. I'll be, we'll be nice. Just be nice, boy. You mind your business, I mind mine. How's that? How's that for a little mother trucker? 
Anyway, yeah, I'm just baffled how close that that horde was. It, I mean, it, the hordes travel quite far. They go to their uh, secondary feeding locations, but... Oh, God. We're screwed. We're screwed. We are screwed. I heard it. Just keep running. I can hear wolves. I can hear every single thing. So, yeah, folks, I am definitely baffled at, you know, what's happening. We could have been attacked any single day of the week. Any single time we would have been there. They travel quite far. Yeah, usually to the most... Well, they travel frequently to the secondary feeding locations, but they do also get around a lot. Meaning we could have been attacked going out or in Good. the checkpoint whilst going to see Sarah. It just baffles me. I still don't believe it. It was a, Obviously, it wasn't a, a, you know, a large horde. It was a quite medium to uh, small horde. So, uh, see you later, bear. I have not got the time for you, boy. Sorry for the hold-up, folks, but we finished fuel, and apparently there was no fuel, any fuel cans around, and then I crashed my bike into there. Uh, I've been really bad at driving lately. Even in the last episode, I was just bad at skidding. For some reason, I, I'm kind of losing traction. It just doesn't turn anymore, for some reason. Maybe it's to do with the settings, but I have no idea. See, it just doesn't turn. What's going on? Have they changed the bike mechanics? My bike just doesn't turn. Even with the skid. Now it does, but... Hmm. It's kind of weird. It's either me getting really bad at driving. What's this? Is that a pipe? I'm going to need that. Yup. Definitely can. A small pipe for the uh, Superior Club. Nice. Keep it going. Oh, wait a second. That's kerosene. Quickly craft this now. We'll pick it up now. All right, very nice. We would have been fine for the horde anyway, even if it was a large or medium to large. Due to the... Uh, we've got the LMG now. Nothing to worry about. All right, bandage. We fall off. Okay, let's go. And there's definitely another fuel can here, so we're good for after or for later. All right, let's get in there, folks. We're obviously going to find some company in here as usual. Just clear out the usual fools. I'm actually, I'm actually an idiot. The last time I came here, which was the second time, we obviously moved this car, and you can actually take the shortcut, which is when you move, uh, when you come here the first time, you actually move the car around. Which means it unlocks a shortcut for you to go in, instead of going all the way around. You can easily use the shortcut. I've now used it where I could have used it a second time instead of going all the way around. I'm such an idiot. All right, let's go. Uh, hey, me again. So uh, I took Boozer into the Lost Lake camp, and I know, <laughs> I know. I told you I was never going back there with Iron Mike threatening to break my neck and all, but didn't have a choice. See, Boozer. Boozer was gonna die, and, uh, well, he still didn't want to go. Hell, I didn't want to go, but, like I said, didn't have a choice. Neither of us did, so it didn't matter. He, um, he lost the arm anyway, and, and now he's stuck. I mean, we're stuck. Goddamn schizo. You know, I can't remember if I told you about this clown, but he's the kind of asshole that's glad all this shit went down. <laughs> he says he was uh, gangbanging in Sacramento and Fresno. I don't remember, but he says he's not from around here, and he's he's not. Claims he was dealing drugs and guns from California to Oregon, and then everything went to hell. And you know what? I think he's full of shit. To me, he kind of looks like a frat boy, like he was on the lacrosse team peddling sodas at a... Mini martyr. No, 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 man. He would have, <laughs> he would have had a cushy job at his old man's accounting firm, making copies and getting everyone their morning coffee. You know, making more in a day than I've ever made in a week. You know, it's this game the Boozer and I used to play before we rode out of Lost Lake for good. We used to call it uh, "Who You Were." You know, we'd look at someone, we'd try to guess who they were before the shit went down. You know, you know, I met a few drug addicts, a lot of ex-cons, uh, no accountants. 
So, that makes sense, if you think about it. First couple of weeks after the ship went down, I mean, Jesus, that was a freak show. There's no way some accountant or pencil pusher lived through that shit, so I don't know, maybe Schizo's was telling the truth. <sighs> I'm not sorry that you missed it. I'm not. Anyway, Boozer and I wanted to head north and get away from all this shit, but that, that, that ain't happening anytime soon, or, or happening ever. Uh, hey, <laughs> look on the bright side. Looks like you're uh, stuck with me. Okay, I'll stop by later. See you. So when he said, I remember I told you something about, uh, you know, Boozer getting... He's full of crap. I think I've... I don't know... If you miss, I don't know if it lets. I don't know if I've missed one, but I think there's only two for now. Every time you you'd see when one of these pops up or not, so I don't think I've missed them. I I don't know. It's just one of the dialogue. One thing he said. It, it seems like I've. Uh, it seemed like I've missed one of these dialogues, which are technically missions. It will give you two thousand XP, which are more than useful because uh, you need the skill points. Then, which that reminds me, um, that we have a skill point too. Uh, do together we'll do that now and i could just hear bikes in the background we may have some raiders we may have some uh, mother truckers waiting for us when we get outside a near a checkpoint i remember dealing with the past 41 percent. i don't think we've missed one actually because otherwise it would tell us it would definitely tell us but if you want to do these uh very well if you want to do these timeline friendly and you want to do these correctly, folks. You need to do these when it when they pop up because you'll talk about what's happened recently. Otherwise, it just would not make sense story-wise. That's what I think, anyway. All right. Uh, let's go to the I Remember mission. And if we have time, we do the Bounty Hunter. Uh, so then we get to do that collectible as well. But for now... Or actually, we're going to have to do a secondary horde today, folks. Simply because we're going to have to take this near a checkpoint down. At least we get the skill point. But we need to do the horde at the sawmill. There's definitely a hoard there because it was in the E3 trade. I don't, I don't see why they would change it. We definitely got the stuff to do so. Uh, so I'm ready. We'll have to use everything we got. Even though we got an LMG. This is a large one. It's nothing like we've ever seen before. And then maybe if I got the time. Maybe by myself, I'm definitely going to do the one where the Nero research point is. Which is here. Uh, somewhere around Hot Springs anyway. Uh, if I remember. It's the, this one here. I've, I've got the Nero research. Uh, I've got the Nero should I say point or the skill point, but I just didn't get the horde because the horde was traveling outside. It was actually going around here where I am now. So we could actually travel there now and get the horde. I might do that now, actually. Yeah, it's a good point, sir. Why not? It's going to be a horde full episode, folks. Let's do this. I wouldn't mind. It's not that large, so I just want to get rid of it. Plus, I want to do the tutorials, or should I say, I want to put them in the walkthrough so then you guys see how to do the hordes. As I'm doing them live, I'm pretty much improvising. There's no tactic. Like I said, you need to get as much distance as possible between you and the horde, and then you're good to shoot. Ouch. All right, let's select the waypoint for the horde, which is literally, we're going to go past it. So, better be ready. Here we go. Let's do this, folks. We didn't get the LMG for nothing. And now he suddenly remembers how to drive. I don't know why. I've just... Uh, I think I was a bit rusty. When I crashed the bike, I just feel a bit rusty. Even though I was doing it at the end of the episode of last episode. You know, everything makes sense. All right, it should be here. Caves over there. We've also got some fuel there just for later. Let's get them, folks. We'll go in with this for now. Yup, they're definitely in here. I can hear them. They are definitely in here. Should I use the last attractor? Might as well. Who's coming? Okay. Come on. Alright, they're coming now. They are coming now. Uh, we're going to use the attractor now. Really? Like half of them came. Really? Now they're all coming. 
Alright, come on. Now they will come. Here we go. Ouch. Oh, there's not actually that many. I think we're getting them. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ouch. Keep it going. Let's keep this going, folks. All right, let's heal. And let's get a focus cocktail as well. And it's time for this baby. Alright, we're off again. Let's go. Let's train him. Let's keep this going. Not many left now, folks. Let's take him for a run. Now. Let's go. And focus again. And this is where we use the club. This is a pretty heavy weapon. That's the only problem. And that should be the horde done. What the hell? What's going on? Why didn't it count as the horde? Really? Oh, Jesus. Folks, there's more. Holy smokes, there is more. What in the heck is going on? How many more? Oh, not too many. Hold up. Get out of there. Get the freaking hell out of there, folks. Come on. Any more? How many more is that? Jesus Christ. Now is there any more? Any more? Come on. There's definitely more, folks. I'd love to know where. Oh, he's here. Oh, he's out. Any more? Holy smokes, there's loads more. Alright, this is where you use this bad boy. This is a long horde, folks. We're gonna have to make ammo count. And Patchen's Lakes Horde has been completed. And that's Hot Springs done. Jesus Christ, this was long. Apart from being long, it was it was large. It was just large. This was we knew that this was a large one, hence why we were always outgunned every single time. But uh yep, we managed to do it. And we also gain that 20%. The reason why I'm doing this now, folks, is because we want that mag upgrade for the... We want that mag upgrade for the SMP9. So I'll, I'll take everything I can. So do we get to switch this off? Because this is the beacon, obviously, but we already got the, the point, the skill point. All right, I guess that's it, folks. Yes, I wasted a lot of my things, but it was definitely worth it. We'll get ammo anyway. Okay, time to go. Let's collect all the bounties and we'll go to the mission. Oh, 
Okay, let's do this. Uh, let's definitely do this. Yeah, it's not a bad weapon, the Superior Club, but I'm not digging it. If I find a good enough melee weapon soon, I'm going to switch it, folks. If Even if I find uh, another baseball bat, I'm going to get the spike bat. It's just so much quicker and it's got more damage. It's a heavy weapon. It's so much slower. It slows down your melee speed. So You're so much more vulnerable to attacks. It was definitely easier with, a, with an LMG, folks. I, w I definitely felt more confident. So much easier. You cannot do this crossbow with AR and an SMG. I have so many bounties to give. This is unreal. See if we got a fast travel point near there. Because that's a long way. Yeah, we'll have to we'll have to travel to Lost Lake, folks. Definitely, because uh, we need to fuel up and we need to, you know, get our stuff back and stuff. Oh, please don't tell me the crow is stuck in the roof again. I will cry my eyes out. Okay. Let's go. Let's get to Lost Lake. And we'll do the... Cannot fast travel bike has insufficient fuel. Oh, damn it. Oh, yeah, we got a fuel can here. That's good. Ooh. And we also got a small pipe. Even though I'm not going to be using it. Oh, here we go. That's it. Really? I had 90% fuel. How have I, haven't I got sufficient fuel to get there? Yes, I know it's up the other side of the map. Alright, let's go. Ah, back in the snow we are, folks. It's good to be back here. All right, let's get in there so we get to refuel the bike as it's literally switching off. Quick, quick. My bike my bike is dead. Come on. Let me in. Yeah, my bike is literally dead, folks. Holy. How's it going? We literally just made it down here. All right, we're going to give all the bounty star on Mike's camp, folks, because we have loads to turn in. I know we have. Oh, I swear, I think... Oh, did you? Man, that's pretty messed up what happened to him. Yeah, but I didn't ask you for your comment. Yeah, yeah, it is. I heard it was Rippers. Is that true? That did it to him, I mean. Yeah, it was Rippers. Look, can we just... Can we not talk about yeah, it? Yeah, change the subject. Anyway, yep, I thought we had more swarm areas and more bounties, but we didn't because we must have... Oh, there's a... Oh, okay. Bro, yeah. two seconds. We got a... I swear we just had a live encounter. Oh. So the live encounter is this guy playing guitar. Right. Right, it's pretty sick. I gotta say, but, you know, I've got more important things to do instead of you playing guitar. Anyway, folks, yep. Pretty sick. Uh, let's sell all. Oh. Got some ears here, okay. I, uh... Oh, wait, he's got some. He's got a pretty sick voice. Obviously, it's not him, but... All right, before we get copyrighted for the song, I'm just going to get out of here. <laughs> anyway, uh... I've got to say, but I think I gave all the other ears and all the other 600 Swarmer ears and stuff, I think I gave them to uh, to this camp uh, in a free roam session. I even remember. I'm pretty sick. Looking for some stuff. Yep, repairing. I'll fill her up. Sick. Sure. Alright, folks. I've reloaded all the weapons. I gave all the uh, bounty or the bounties. Uh, um, and I wanted to actually end the episode with Ricky Patel's mission. As we've not done Ricky's mission yet. We've not done a camp mission yet. And I don't think we'll have enough time to do an actual mission. Because we have the sawmill uh, horde over there. And it's one of the hardest hordes in the game. It's actually the largest, if I remember, uh, horde in the game. And it's going to take so much time. So I'd rather actually do this mission. And just to close off the episode, and in the next next episode, we'll start off the episode with the Sawmill Horde. And after that, we'll head on for the I Remember uh, storyline. Let's do this, folks. Hey, Ricky. You said you had a job for me? Hey, Deke. Yeah. You remember Shane Riley? Everyone called him Red? Red Riley. Yeah, never heard of him, but let me guess. Ginger? But 
red hair? No. It was his boots. He wore these rattlesnake boots dyed with god-awful red color. He made quite the impression. <laughs> no, I bet. Anyway, he used to do runs for us back in the day until one day he decides he didn't like the camp credits we were paying. So he up and kills Lindsay Fuller. Who? Lindsay. Worked supply before Blair. Wait a second, so he killed an unarmed woman? Oh, she was armed. She just wasn't expecting him to shoot her in the face. Will you listen? So Red murders her, cleans out her supply hut, and then takes off before anyone knows what's happened. Got away clean. Oh, that son of a bitch. Until now. He and his men have been spotted up at Camp Pioneer. You don't gotta ask. I, uh, I got this thing about, um... About killing unarmed women. I know. So I knew you'd want to handle it. Yeah, like I said, I got this covered. Um, what else can you tell me about him? Not much. Oh, wait. He chews tobacco. I heard he was such an addict that he rounds up cigarette butts, takes out the tobacco, and chews that. Well, that's disgusting. So now I got two reasons to kill him. Yeah, but be careful, Deke. It's a common thing, chewing tobacco. I know about it. I mean, I'm, I've seen people do it with cigars. It's, it's actually really good for you. Whoa. Provided that you don't abuse it, just like anything else, everything with a correct, you know, uh, correct balance, then it's all good for you. But, yeah, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. Folks, before we head out to get him, I want to do the historical camp mark marker, wherever it is, because I've, it's been clinging the whole time and I haven't still done it. I mean, it's a collectible solve. Come on. But yeah, folks, if we would have done the horde, I know that horde. I've seen videos of that horde. It is astounding. I have never seen anything that freaking large. It, it, I think it'd take about an hour to kill that horde. You need the correct weaponry, the correct tactics, correct strategies, how you're going to do it, and how you're going to, you know, just try and even go about it. So let's deselect that, and let's go for the bounty hunter. And we'll close off the episode like this, folks. It is just not logical accessing that now. So I'd say let's get some supplies back and stuff like that before actually accessing something that's even probably one of the hardest hordes or maybe the hardest horde in the game. I don't think this is going to be too hard. It's a bounty hunter mission. So uh, we get to use our stealth and we'll be good. And then I crashed the bike like that. Honestly, my driving for these days has been shocking. I already said I have problems like turning the bike for some reason. The mechanics, the driving mechanics don't feel smooth. They better have not nerfed them in the uh, latest patches with the survival mode and stuff. See, I just I just struggle turning my bike for some reason. I have to skid every single time. Really weird. If they if they definitely nerfed it, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna be very disappointed. At least this will get our level 2 or it will get us uh, XP to get us to level 2 camp uh, trust. So we can buy some more bike upgrades, but especially some weaponry from uh, Iron Mike's because they definitely got the best. They got the best things, folks. And I crushed the bike again. I don't know. Folks, my driving is just not there. Guess it happens, huh? Just got to roll with it. Here we go, we should be getting close, folks. Yeah, we can't pioneer. This is where we unlocked our... Uh... Hey, Ricky, I'm a camp pioneer, and it is a goddamn war zone. What's going on? Are any of our guys there? Uh, no, I don't think so. It sounds like they're clearing freaks. Uh, don't worry. Find this guy. Deacon out. And it better not be uh, another horde, folks. I'm kind of fed up with hordes. We've done three... We've done... Sorry, we've done two in a row. That's why exactly I didn't want to do a third one. I know three is the magic number, but it's just not what I wanted for the episode. All right, right. Where the hell are you? Newts. Oh, wow, well, they're killing newts. Now we've got to find this guy. They're clearing out freaks. Let's uh, use that as a distraction, shall we? Yeah. Nice. Okay, what's this? Okay, yes, yes. Cigarette butts, yes. Indeed. He likes chewing tobacco, remember? Four bounties. Oh, this guy died. Well, it's life, bro. You know, you got owned. That newt comes near me, I will kill it. Oh, prince. Oh, no. uh, these things like uh, the kind of prince that some fancy cowboy can take. Holy. Alright, that's our chance. 
sorry, girl, but uh, you're in my way. Let's get this baby on with a suppressor. Gonna need it. Please don't turn around. Cover. Need cover. From what exactly? Okay, see you later. Let's find out some more tobacco or some more leads. Here we go, we've got some here. Ah, that's tobacco's bed. Is he shooting at us? Finally, you are one gross motherfucker. Oh, you can actually see him spit with the a sick. I see what she's got. We can we need things, folks. A rag, yeah, don't mind that. Let's craft one of these. What else are we missing? Uh, we'll just craft one because what we're hoping that we find one. Uh, okay, what do we need? Uh, bearberry. Sterilize, that's fine. That's maxed. Uh, what else do we need? Oh, mica cap, that's fine. We've got it. All right, that's cool. We're doing good. Nice and smooth. They're going in at the newts. We'll use that, like I said, as a distraction. We'll come back and uh, loot everything that we need. So far, so good, folks. Yeah, this way. That newts. It, come on. I dare you to. Come near me. I actually want to leave him alive because, it's, like I said, it's good distraction. Newt. That's right. Jump out of the way. I actually hate them because they're kids. It makes me actually feel bad at my bum about myself killing them, but then I realize they're freaking zombies, so get off me. Alright, let's see quickly the diagram because it looks sick. Which just reminds me of that uh, detective mode from Batman Arkham. So sick. I can hear some more bikes. I think they got reinforcement. Yep, they do. Where are these guys going? Are these guys stopping? Definitely going into Ripper territory because if you cross that bridge, that's definitely Ripper territory there. All right, let's get this baby out, folks. They're definitely coming over here. Where are you guys going? Let's try and sneak there. I'm right, getting caught. Cool. We'll take the guy out on the right because the guy on the left has turned around. First guy's out. He didn't even hear it. Nice. It's because I had we had a suppressor on and we take out this guy stealthily. Love it. Through the helmet. Let's go. One attractor and one sterilizer. We'd love to see it. you love to see it. Uh, I would rather sabotage their bikes. Even though we could have had the uh, scraps from somewhere else. How many scraps? Three scraps. We're all right. Now we're maxed. Very nice. Here we go. What okay, the? Here we go. What did we just do? Oh, good. Good, 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 good. All right, let's search the next clue. Freaks. Oh, love that soundtrack. Oh, hello. You. Damn it. Really? Really, bro? Where did you guys come from? Oh, he's in He's in the actual toilets. Okay. Come on, come on. Ah, uh, we use a med kit because there's a med kit around here, so... Is he getting killed? Where you at? Really? Oh, get off me. That's right. Nice. Really? Down you go. I found a bandage. Keep him coming. He's got a pipe bomb. Damn, these guys got a lot. Newt, really? Come on, I got things to do. Okay. Oh, good. You're in. Jesus. Well, if you gotta go, you gotta go. All right, I'm guessing this way. Oh, hello, hello, Newt. All right, I get. I tell you what, folks, we're gonna use a bandage actually now, uh, and then we get the bandage back, and now we just have to get the med kit, the next med kit, should I say? Off the either a guy that has it or somewhere over here. Damn, there's a lot of things to search in this town. New tier, I'll take, I'll take. Keep them coming. Ah, we got a new fool up there.
Let him get closer. Don't want to miss the shot. Here we go. And he's out. Did you actually see that from up there? Jesus. Deuce to you, bro. We'll get this guy, folks, real quick. I need to search this place. It's bound to have... It's got so much stuff since these guys have uh, come in. Okay, here we go. I think we found him. He's in here, Red Riley. Are we circled round? Just trying to find where this guy. Oh, here we go. Oh, he's out. Yeah, he was telling us to go this way anyway. Alright, let's unlock the door, folks. Uh, maybe not. Must be a. Definitely a rooftop entrance. Yeah, I knew it. I thought the Collect the boots. Proof of kill. Oh, that, I didn't know he was not dead. Okay, good. One med kit. Thank you. Yeah, folks, I was going to shoot him, but then I thought you needed him alive. And then I said, oh, shit. What am I meant to do? And then I realized that he started killing me. Then I was like, ah, oh, no, that's it. You've done it now, boy. Okay. Folks, I'm going to have to uh, search this by myself at some point. But the problem is... We go out of it now. We trigger a checkpoint. Triggering the checkpoint will mean scrap inventory full. I'll tell you what. If it is full, we use it now and we search him real quick. Two scraps. Sick. He's got two of those. I'm going to sabotage your bike real quick. I'm also going to use a uh, bandage real quick. Very nice. We'll have to fast travel to Lost Lake anyway. Now, where was the med kit we saw originally? It was somewhere around here, wasn't it? We just need the bandage, really. Med kit inventory full. Ah, here you go. We should have used this med kit, not the bandage. But there's definitely people with bandages and stuff. Just move out of the way. Their noises are so annoying. There we go. This guy's got a bandage. Nice. All right, folks. We'll uh, fuel up the bike as well. Oh, actually, do we have enough fuel? Let's just get back to Lost Lake. We'll fast travel and then we'll end the episode, folks. I think we searched everything. Bro, the bounty's done. There's no point of looking at the clues anymore. Really, Deke? Really? Now you're looking at all the clues? I'm loving the weather mechanics. I don't know how many times I've mentioned this, folks, but it's true. It's amazing. Oh, we got a lot of stuff out here. Jeez. Mine now. No, it's not. That's not what I wanted. Give me back my AR. Thank you. Alright, we got a pipe bomb back and we got a few things back. We got a tractor. We got a smoke bomb we can craft full. Uh gunpowder, rag can, that's good. I'll take. So what's to take? The two rag or the one rag? Nice. Uh need to get in here, folks. Thank you. What's in here? Bandage. All sorts in here. Stool leg, which we don't need. Is that a hatchet? Fire axe. Holy smokes. Look at the damage, but the durability is... It is what it is. I might actually take this. Because it's, if it is a one-hit kill... Um, uh, I'm just impressed. It's just going to be so much easier to kill. And obviously, you're, you're repairing it consist like consistently and frequently, but... It's better than what we're using now, folks. A lot better. What's the X's? I don't understand. Oh, they're outside, I think. Yep, they are. Or they're, I think they're on top of the roof. Yeah, they've been killed on top of the roof. They're newts. I can't climb on there. Okay, let's get back to the bike and let's just travel back to uh, Lost Lake. I think we've searched everything we needed. Definitely not gonna... Like I said, we can't do... We need a new sidearm suppressor and the suppressor 100%, so they're fine. 
Uh, traps, proximity, my proximity, we never use them. That's fine. All right, I think we're sorted, folks. We're not doing too bad. And obviously for the next episode, I cannot wait because it's going to be a real good one. We're we'll going to be killing the sawmill horde. Let's get in. Let's finish this mission. Let's get our trust. Let's see if we get that level two. Hold on. I know him. Open up. Hey, good to see you. Hey, hey, Ricky. I got him. Deacon, what a relief. Lindsay has some folks she was close to. I'll let him know. Yeah, okay. I'll see you around, Ricky. God damn, Warzone. It was indeed... Our mics, yes, no. Oh, are you kidding me? We got one buff, really. We literally got 200 more XP in, and we should be to level two. That we did all of that, all of that effort, and it has not been repaid. Well, it is what it is, folks. At least we've completed a lot this episode. We've done two hordes, one dialogue mission, one side mission. It has been a very productive, very, very productive episode in terms of storyline in my own time i'm probably going to complete these research sites we can't complete the sawmill because we do that we're doing this together this is one hell of a horde that we're going to do together but it's we have to do it because it's right next to mission point i'm just you know it we are obviously going to run into it especially if it wants us to search it it wants us to search camp pioneer because we can see it in the picture but the thing is it's all close together camp pioneer is really close to uh the sawmill i'm surprised how we didn't run into that uh, sawmill horde right now but yeah it is what it is and then obviously in my time, I'll do these research centers, folks, and uh, to, gain, to gain more uh, statistics and skill points. We're going to quickly finish off doing this skill point uh, together, that level 16 uh, skill point, and we might put it into ranged combat, and we need it. Into significantly reduces ranged weapon recoil. Uh, what else have we got? Reduce the reload times for ranged weapons. That's really good. Uh, no longer consume focus when reloading on a ranged weapon. What? So no longer consume focus when reloading a ranged weapon. So, okay, so whilst you're in focus, if you do reload, it doesn't consume focus. That's really, really, really freaking good. And then what's this? Hyperfocus improves the initial recovery and duration to a focus cocktail. That's really sick as well. Suppress and fire when in focus, ranged weapons will have an increased power to stop weaker enemies. That I freaking love because it's just, it's it's really good for uh, whores as well. I might put suppress and fires because it just unlocks everything. Yep, we're going to do it. I should really put it into survival. We've hardly unlocked anything. Here we go. Suppressing fire. Nice. I've hardly unlocked anything in survival. We need green... F I've only got for green farm. Ability to gather double the plants. We need this. We definitely need green farm. Yeah, of course. I've put this in my tutorial video. Uh, and increase the range of survival vision. We need this as well. We need a lot of stuff in survival. I'm going to stop uh, putting it into ranged... Otherwise, become a killing machine, but not a survival machine. Anyway, folks, hopefully you've enjoyed this. Keep smashing that thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new to the family. Don't forget to follow me on social media, and I will see you in the next episode of Days Gone. Johnson, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done.